everyone, thanks for joining me today. Uh, this is not a gameplay video, I'm just going to be opening packs. Um, after the last event that I put up a couple of videos, I was able to do some booster crafting. And as far as legacy cards go, uh, I was able to get all the commons and uncommons. And I'm down to 108 uh, rares with uh, 400 mythics and 200 masterpiece. I did not convert anything for mythics. And if we go over to the vault, um, you can see I've got 14 packs, and these are all guaranteed non-duplicates. And this is all this video is going to be, is opening these packs and uh, taking a look at um, what we get. I just thought it'd be fun to open packs that were nothing more than rares, um, mythics, and hopefully some masterpiece cards. I'm not going to spend a lot of time reviewing each card, um, just opening them up, trying to see what, uh, uh, that's exciting. Um, this is actually what's important to me. I'm curious to see if I'll be able to finish any of the Planeswalkers that I have. So, uh, <laughs> thank you, and we'll go to the next one. But I figure if you see a card that you're interested in, you can pause the video and take a look at it. I think here in the near future, I'm actually going to start a series of um, card profiles, different cards that I think are noteworthy or cards that I think are overpowered uh, or cards that I just think are, oh, Ember Cleave is very exciting, um, at least for me, um, and cards that I think uh, are um, maybe overlooked. So we'll see how that goes. I'll try and put some of those together and post them up. And since I'll be opening up all these ridiculous cards here, uh, I should have plenty of content. Um, that's, I don't know what that is, but it looks interesting. That also looks interesting. <laughs> that one looked fun. Uh, another update. Oh, and it's Master Deck, so I just got... I think that's three for that same deck, which was exciting. Open another pack. Uh, I feel very fortunate. I've received a lot of mythics comparable to the rares. I mean, I mean, it was what a hundred to uh, a lot of people play that card, so that's exciting. Um, uh, what did we see? It was the difference between a hundred and um, four hundred? So I mean, statistically. But still, you know, I expected to get a lot more uh, simple rares. Uh, that's an exciting card. Than uh, the Mythics and the Masterpieces. And we saw a couple of Masterpieces, so that was exciting. Six, fetch six creatures. That's amazing. That's probably going to have to go into another Masterpiece. That's exciting. Uh, hold on, just real quick. Where is it? There it is. You fetch six creatures from your library. So, I mean, it's just going to fill your hand. But for ten... I, I love a card like that because, see, I can make a video on that card. The the fact that you could build a deck with one creature, um, yeah, something like a self-replicator or another masterpiece card, a uh, self-replicator or um, anything else that boosts itself, I just, is exciting. Lots of mythics. This is, uh, this is very fun for me. Um, I hope that some of you guys were able to play the Planeswalker event, what did they call it, Ultimate Planeswalk, and were able to get um, some conversions and some packs. I was a little disappointed that they changed the rewards on this most recent um, event. And I haven't seen anything, I, I haven't checked Reddit to see what people are saying right now, but I'm curious to see if there were any updates Oh, I got a completed set. Awesome. Let's see what got updated. Uh, Gideon and Liliana. But who got completed? Oh. What did we get? Oh, that's not what I wanted. But let's see what we got. Charnel Troll. Very cool. That's exciting. This is, this is what I'm excited about. So, we'll continue. We got five more packs, which is 25 more cards. Oh, and these two down here. So, seven more packs. 
Uh, Battle of Mammoth. That's exciting. That's a card I've been wanting for a long time. Oh, wow. Okay, that's exciting. Uh, that card's been played against me so many times, and every time I see it, I'm like, I want that in my set. So I'm very excited to have received that one. And another completed. Oh, how interesting. This is a newer, newer Planeswalker that I've purchased. And updated. Oops, no, this is what I wanted. Oh, so... Interesting. Okay. Oh, she probably the same card shared in uh, both sets. Six packs to go. Leyline, uh, Leyline Tyrant. Um, I was first introduced to the idea of ley lines in a... Ooh, a Mox Opal! How exciting! Um, I was first introduced to Leylines and Worldbreaker, that's also fun, uh, in a role-playing game called Rifts, uh, put out by Palladium Press. Um, I believe... I can't think of the name of the writer. I feel terrible. Kevin? I don't know. I've forgotten. Uh, but it was one of my favorite um, role-playing games of all time. Of course, I haven't... Uh, been able to play for some time because I can't find anybody else that plays with that engine. A lot of people are playing Dungeons and Dragons now, which is nice that people are role-playing again, but um, I, I miss Rifts. I actually want to look at something here real quick. This looked fun. <laughs> well, I am glad you joined me for this video. Um, like I said, no gameplay, just a bunch of cards. But I just thought it would be exciting to open these packs that are all ridiculous. I mean, all these mythics and masterpieces and a handful of uh, rares. Oh, Frost Titan, that's neat. Um, and another masterpiece card, how exciting. This is definitely... Wow! 10 damage and destroy all the gems. That's ridiculous. Uh, it's also going to give me a lot of uh, cards that I can work on um, uh, leveling up and um, ranking. So that, that's also exciting for me. I got Mox Amber. So I got a Mox Opal and a Mox Amber. Oh! I've seen a lot of people play this card as well, so that's exciting. Green cards. Huh. Metalwork Colossus. I've had that played against me quite a bit. That's exciting. And an Archmage. Another update. Who is this? Karn? Was that Karn? Yeah. So we'll... Last pack. This has been a lot of fun. What do we got? Uh, that card gets played against me quite a bit, so that's exciting. Oh! Love my dinosaurs. I need to build a dinosaur deck. Um, and play that up a couple of times. Anyway. Oh, we got another update. Who did we get? Uh, is that Bolus? I think this is a Bolus deck. Okay, well, there you go. Um, I no longer have any more packs. That was a fast opening, but it was still an opening. Um, where are your cards? And then we can go filters. And like that. So, I have plenty of new cards. Still have some older cards that still need to be ranked up. But lots of stuff to play with now. Lots of new decks to work on. And I'm going to start doing card profiles here pretty soon. Just shorter videos talking about different cards. Because um, sometimes you'll get a really good card. You'll get a, a mythic or a masterpiece. But you're not sure how to build up around it. Or um, which planeswalkers might um, best uh, uh, complement it. So that's kind of what I want to put together and help out. Again, everyone who's doing free to play. And uh, trying, you know, trying to get ahead. Especially newer players. When there are players like myself who've been playing 
for a long time, and so we've established nice collections, and uh, sometimes it just feels it can be uneven. Um, anyway, that's all this is about. I appreciate you guys watching. I will try and put together a play video here pretty soon, or another recommendation video. Uh, and until then, take care, and I'll see you next time.